Do you guys got a fish or a shellfish that you can use to make a lovely dish that you guys can serve at your table with your friends and family? Well, get them out as we are making a nice fish cake today. Hello guys, my name is Ron and welcome to the Noibu Chef. First thing we need to do to make the lovely dish is to make the base flavor of the cake which is the garlic, the chili, the ginger and the spring onion. I've got my little assistant in here guys that will help me to do the job. If you guys got a food processor at home, use it. Prepare all four ingredients and run them to a food processor. Then I'm gonna blitz this one manually. Once you reach this stage, you can transfer the mix into a bowl. For my fish cake, I'm gonna use a salmon, sea bass and some prawns. Guys, make sure when making a fish cake, whatever fish you use, the bone and the skin should be taken off. I'm gonna start with my prawns. I'm gonna blitz this one till it becomes fine. You don't want it to be too smooth, guys. Then afterwards, the salmon. Same process. I'm gonna blitz it till it becomes fine. And then my white fish, which is the sea bass. I'm gonna take off the skin first, cut it into chunk, put it in the food processor, and then do the same process. As soon as we finish preparing the fish, we can start adding some flavor in it by adding some chopped coriander, some lemon zest in it. It should be lime actually guys, but I don't have any lime so we're using lemon. But if you guys got a lime at home, it's better. Then I'm gonna add fish sauce in it, about two tablespoons, some salt, pepper, some seasoning as well guys if you have as you want to boost the flavor. Then I'm gonna add a touch of sesame oil in it. Mix it, then drizzle it with some lemon juice. Mix it again, and that's it. For this recipe, we are not using egg, flour, or panko breadcrumbs. So for people who's allergic with egg and gluten, this recipe is for you guys. Now we're ready for cooking. Get yourself a pan, set it in a medium heat, Add some good amount of oil in it. Then you can start portioning the fish cake using your hands. Fish cake mix can stick with our hands. I suggest before you touch the mix, cover your hands with some oil in it. Once you're ready, you can start portioning the fish cake with whatever size you want them to be. You can portion it with a big chunky size or a bite size, it's up to you really. Try to make it round as possible. Roll it in your hand, then carefully drop it in a pan. Guys, as always, make sure when cooking something in a pan, you got enough space for them to cook properly. Cook them till they reach golden brown in color. Flip it on the other side. Normally, this size of fish cake should be done 4 to 5 minutes. You don't want to overcook it as it's not gonna be so nice. Once it's cooked, transfer the cakes into a plate with some white roll in it, just to make sure we remove the excess fat in it. Then after a few minutes, guys, we can start serving it. Grab a plate. I'm gonna serve them with some nice sweet chili sauce in. Drop your fish cake in. Add some garnish in it like spring onion, chilies and coriander. You can do parsley if you like and some lemon. And there you have it. Fish cake with sweet chili sauce. really good thanks so for watching guys see you later hey guys if you enjoyed watching this video please don't forget to give me a big thumbs up drop me some comments or suggestion down below click the follow or the subscribe button for more videos updates and I'll see you all next time for the next cooking session of Tonoi Pichet